The night was clear and starlit, the houses on our right were silently peering out from behind the trees. These are the words that introduce us to the enchanting world of White Knights, penned by the master of Russian literature, Fyodor Dostoevsky. Published in 1848, this novella transports us into the heart of an unnamed Russian city, steeped in the mystery and mystique that only a knight can offer. Dostoevsky, in his typical fashion, uses the setting not merely as a backdrop, but as a character in itself. The city, with its shadowy corners and silent streets, mirrors the solitude and introspection of our protagonist. The starlit night parallels the dreamer's internal world, a space filled with thoughts, hopes, and unexpressed emotions. The city at night in Dostoevsky's hands becomes a stage where the drama of human existence unfolds. And so begins our journey into this starlit night, where we meet our unnamed protagonist, a dreamer lost in his own world. Our protagonist, a loner, a dreamer, finds solace not in the company of others, but in the depths of his daydreams. This man, our protagonist, exists on the periphery of society. He's an outsider, a recluse, someone who is more at home in the fantastical worlds he creates in his mind than in the bustling streets of St. Petersburg. His isolation is both self-imposed and circumstantial. He feels a disconnect, a chasm between himself and the world around him. It's not that he doesn't desire human connection, but rather he's unable to find it. He's a man out of sync with his surroundings, a dreamer lost in his own fantasies. But our dreamer is not a static character. He evolves, changes, and grows. And it is this growth that forms the crux of his narrative. His transformation begins with a chance encounter, a fleeting moment that alters the course of his life. He meets Nastenka, a young woman, beautiful, innocent, and as lost as he is. She's a beacon of light in his world of dreams and fantasies. The encounter with Nastenka is pivotal. It's a catalyst that pushes our protagonist out of his daydreams and into the harsh, yet beautiful, realities of life. She becomes a tangible connection, a bridge between his dreams and reality. Their interactions bring him face to face with the raw emotions of human connection, joy, love, sorrow, and despair. Their relationship is a dance of sorts, a delicate ballet between two lost souls seeking solace, understanding, and companionship. It's this dance, this push and pull between dreams and reality, that gives our protagonist a new perspective, a new understanding of himself and the world around him. And yet, the dreamer in him never truly fades away. It merely evolves, adapting to the newfound reality of human connection. His dreams become less about escapism and more about hope, love, and the promise of a shared future. It is in this encounter that we see the dreamer awaken to the reality of human connection. Nastenka, a young woman waiting for her lover, becomes the beacon of reality for our dreamer. Nastenka, a character who is as complex as she is captivating, serves as a pivotal component in our dreamer's journey. She is a young woman, burdened with a life that is far from ideal, yet she clings to her love with a tenacity that is both admirable and heartbreaking. Abandoned by her mother and raised by a blind, tyrannical grandmother, her life is a study in contrasts, a testament to the power of endurance and the human spirit's capacity for hope. Her lover, an absent figure, is the very essence of her longing. He is a promise of a better life, a beacon of hope in her otherwise dreary existence. Yet, his absence is a constant reminder of the uncertainty that plagues her life. It's a tale that's as old as time, of waiting, of longing, and of a love that's kept alive in the face of adversity. Now let's shift our gaze to how Nastenka's story influences our protagonist. Upon hearing her tale, the dreamer's perspective on life and love undergoes a profound transformation. The dreamer, who has been living in a world of his own creation, is suddenly confronted with the harsh realities of life. He sees in Nastenka a resilience and a purity of love that he has never encountered in his dreams. Her story, steeped in reality, serves as a stark contrast to his dream-filled existence. Nastenka's story also serves as a catalyst for the dreamer's emotional growth. He begins to understand the complexities of love, the pain of longing, and the beauty of waiting. He learns that love is not just about idealistic fantasies, but about endurance, sacrifice, and a steadfast commitment to the one you love. In essence, Nastenka's tale is a mirror that reflects the dreamer's own shortcomings and his need for growth. It's a tale that forces him to step out of his dream world and face reality. In Nastenka's story, our dreamer finds a purpose beyond his dreams. White Nights is not merely a story of two strangers meeting on a starlit night, 
It is a profound exploration of love and loneliness. The theme of love in White Nights is a complex one, woven intricately into the fabric of the narrative. It is not the conventional romantic love we often encounter in literature, but a more profound, desperate kind, born out of solitude and longing. Dostoevsky presents us with a dreamer, a man who, in his fervent isolation, has constructed an idealistic vision of love. When he meets Nastenka, he projects this vision onto her, creating a love that is as much a product of his imagination as it is a genuine affection. This love is beautifully contrasted with the stark loneliness that pervades the story. The dreamer's isolation is not merely physical but also emotional and psychological. He is a man disconnected, living in his dreams and fantasies, separated from the world around him. His loneliness is so profound that it shapes his perception of reality, coloring his interactions with Nastenka in the world. Nastenka too is a character marked by solitude. Her loneliness, however, is not self-imposed like the dreamer's. It is a product of her circumstances, forced upon her by the cruel hand of fate. Her yearning for companionship and understanding resonates throughout the narrative, providing a poignant counterpoint to the dreamer's self-inflicted isolation. The interplay between these two characters, their shared moments of connection, and their individual experiences of love and loneliness, create a powerful exploration of human emotion. It is through their interactions that Dostoevsky delves into the dichotomy of desire and despair, of longing and loss. In exploring these themes, Dostoevsky paints a poignant picture of human longing and the need for connection. White Nights becomes more than a story of two strangers on a starlit night. It becomes a mirror, reflecting our own struggles with love and loneliness, our yearning for connection, and our fear of isolation. As the White Nights give way to the dawn, our dreamer is forced to confront the reality of his feelings for Nastenka. The climax of the story presents us with a profound moment of truth. Our protagonist, the dreamer, pours his heart out to Nastenka, confessing his deep unrequited love for her. He has been living in a world of dreams and fantasies, but now he must face the harsh light of day. He must face reality. Nastenka, the object of his affection, is forced to make a decision. Does she reciprocate his feelings or does she reject him, shattering his dreams and plunging him back into the loneliness he so fears? This pivotal moment in the story affects the dreamer's perception of his dreams and reality. His dreams, once beautiful and comforting, now seem fragile and ephemeral. The reality that he has been avoiding now stands before him, stark and unyielding. He is caught in a struggle between his dreams and the reality, between what he wishes for and what truly is. This struggle is particularly poignant because it is something that all of us, at some point in our lives, can relate to. We have all had dreams that we cherished, only to have them clash with reality. We have all had to navigate the delicate balance between what we desire and what we have. The dreamer's awakening is a powerful metaphor for this universal human experience. It is a testament to Dostoevsky's skill as a writer that he can depict this struggle in such a relatable and emotive way. As the story concludes, we see the dreamer grappling with his newfound awareness. His world is no longer solely a dream, but a blend of dreams and reality. He must reconcile these two facets of his existence, a task that is as daunting as it is necessary. In this awakening, the dreamer must reconcile his dreams with reality, a struggle that is at the heart of Dostoevsky's White Nights. White Nights, a tale of love and loneliness, takes us on a journey through a dreamer's awakening. This poignant narrative, woven with Dostoevsky's masterful storytelling, introduces us to a dreamer's tale, a night like no other, where reality and dreams intertwine. We're led through the intricate narrative of Nastenka, a character as complex as the night itself, Themes of love and loneliness echo throughout the pages, painting a picture of the human condition that is as striking as it is profound. The dreamer's awakening, a moment of harsh reality, serves as a stark contrast to the dreamlike world we've been immersed in. The significance of this book lies not just in its narrative, but in its exploration of the human psyche and the complexities of human connections. And so, as we step out of this starlit night, we carry with us a tale that reminds us of the beauty and pain of human connection, a theme that resonates even after the book is closed.